The church is in the sexual battle of its life. If you take it just a standard cookie cutter Christian, don't do this, don't do that, it won't work. It's going to really sweep through the church like a tsunami wave of destruction of the family. I had wanted to fly a jet aircraft since I was four years old. I wanted to be a fighter pilot. Hey. And so it was all I was living for. Still think you're a hot shot? You won't last 10 seconds in combat. You know how to fly, but you don't know how to fight. You have to understand how the enemy is personally bushwhacking you. This is an ambush. I'm rolling in. Come on. I was an alcoholic. I was a sex addict. I was completely out of control. Like I had a rope around my leg, they have a noose around their soul. And the harder they pull against it, the worse it gets. That's why trying harder doesn't work. You have to know your enemy if you're going to win. It's not just going to go away. Just the power of sexual bondage. It promises you everything, gives you absolutely nothing. It feels as if there's no hope you're never getting out of this. But the shed blood of Jesus Christ guarantees there's a way out. God guarantees you. His word is very clear. The curse will be visited the third or fourth generation. We will create trails in our brain that are just gonna fire on an automatic sequence. You're fighting for the very lineage that God gave you. What a man does in life becomes history, but what he puts into motion becomes his legacy. And if you will break this curse, then your sons and your daughters have a better shot. It took me three and a half years, but I'll tell you now, you know what I'm having the joy of? Is sweet revenge. The very thing the enemy used against me as a weapon, now God is forged by the hammer of his adversity that he's brought in my life, by the hammer of his challenges, by the correction of my soul, and he's formed it into a weapon, and I'm taking sweet revenge against the enemy. And that's what God has for you. one bad day determine who you are and how you can fly. It will put a weapon in your hand that you can conquer and begin to help other men. I believe in you, Roberts.